This is our fourth video on biomagnetic pair therapy and our first video on healing the symptoms known as autism. Hi, this is Devin Lockett at the Biomed RX Health Center. I wanted to make this video uh, to talk about healing the symptoms known as autism. There's gonna be a series of videos addressing autism. Autism is a condition that is of significant importance to me because it's actually the reason why I opened the Biomed RX Health Center. Um, my history is in biomedical engineering, repair, calibration, installation of medical equipment. And my son was diagnosed on the autism spectrum when he was two years old. This was about 11 years ago. Because of my history in biomedical engineering, I was gracefully allowed to study um, neurofeedback or EEG biofeedback therapy at the EEG Institute in Woodland Hills, California. And that was the beginning of the Biometrics Health Center. That was the first service that we offered here at the Biometrics Health Center. While treating clients um, with neurofeedback, I discovered biomagnetic pair therapy. That led me to study biomagnetic pair therapy under um, Dr. David Goyes, who is the son of Dr. Isaac Goyes, the inventor of biomagnetic pair therapy. Autism spectrum disorder is a condition that has reached epidemic levels in the United States in children, especially boys. There is a lot of controversy surrounding the possible link between vaccines and autism. Although I do have some very strong opinions about the subject, that is not the purpose of this video. The purpose of this video is to teach you how you can effectively address the symptoms known as autism using 10 pairs of permanent magnets. While biomagnetic pair therapy should never be considered the only treatment for any condition, the pH balancing that results from the biomagnetic pair therapy process creates the perfect milieu or the perfect internal environment for healing to take place. Pathogens such as virus, bacteria, fungus, and parasites can create pH imbalances in the body. pH imbalances such as pockets of acidity or pockets of alkalinity in areas of the body called reservoirs can also create the perfect environment for pathogens to develop or reside in the body. In the end, all disease comes down to the body's failure to eliminate. By first finding and then depolarizing pH imbalances in the body using only magnets, we can assist the body's own detoxification process. One word of caution, it is extremely important to be very well hydrated before and during and after the biomagnetic pair therapy process. If you are not well hydrated, the magnets may actually make you feel worse. Magnets cause dehydration in the body. Okay, so now we're going to review the pairs that we need to use for biomagnetic pair therapy for children on the autism spectrum. The first pair is cerebellum, cerebellum, right above and below the brain stem, right here on the back of the head, um, as you can see in the illustrations behind me. This is a reservoir for the Epstein-Barr virus. The magnets go right above and below the brain stem. This pair is effective at treating tetanus, seizures while they are occurring, epilepsy, bruxism, which is teeth grinding, neck pain, altered speech, and vertigo. This pair is also good for clearing the mind. The next pair is the left traverse colon and the superior pubic ramus on the left side. These are both on the left side. As you know, the traverse colon goes right here, okay, across the top. And the superior pubic ramus is just below the navel uh, on the pubic bone, just on the left-hand side. This pair is associated with toxicity in the brain, autism, and multiple sclerosis. It's also a good pair for helping to remove parasites. And it can aid chlorine dioxide in clearing biofilm from the intestines. The next biomagnetic pair is diaphragm to diaphragm, right here, right across the diaphragm, right in the area that expands uh, when you're breathing. In addition to treating autism, this pair is also good for treating candida albicans, yeast infections, rectal infections, eye infections, respiratory infections, 
gastric problems, cystitis, mucus disease, like I mentioned before, um, biofilm, rubella in children, and measles in adults, as well as HIV infection. The next biomagnetic pair is dorsal vertebrae number four and lumbar vertebrae number three between the scapula and right above the small of the back. This is a good pair for addressing diphtheria, tracheobronchial problems, chronic cough, diarrhea, general edema, and problems that result from consuming dairy products. The next pair is dorsal vertebrae number five and lumbar vertebrae number two, pretty close to the last two between the scapula and right above the small of the back, or you could maybe say at the bra line. This pair is also good for addressing meningitis, ventilatory insufficiency, rheumatism and joint inflammation. The next pair is esophagus duodenum. The esophagus is the tube that runs uh, from the mouth to the stomach, carrying your food from the mouth to the stomach. The position is right here for the esophagus magnet. And the duodenum is the first segment of the small intestine as the food leaves the stomach. Um, most of your digestion takes place in the first one third of the small intestine, in the stomach and in the first one third of the small intestine. This is a good pair for um, assisting with the gut-brain connection. The next pair is the vagus nerve and the contralateral kidney. The right vagus nerve and the kidney on the left side of the body. Besides dealing with autism, this pair is also very effective at dealing with lactose intolerance, medium to acute depression, fungi, parasites, and bacteria, digestive disorders with diarrhea, poor digestion with gas, <laughs> migraine headache, and fever. The next pair we will address is temple to temple. Okay, now the templar lobe of the brain actually goes from here all the way to the back, right? But most people, when you say temples, they're thinking about this part of the head right along the side of the, uh, of the eyes, right? So this is the area where we're gonna put negative and positive magnets. This pair is very good for addressing hypertension, cerebral and pulmonary blood irrigation, pulmonary emphysema, headache, chronic myofascial pain, and maxillary tooth pain. Finally, we're going to address the pair of the uh, right temple to the right temple, but it's not gonna be up here, it's going to be back here. Right temple to right temple. Okay, this is a very significant uh, pair, biomagnetic pair, not only for autism, but for a lot of other conditions. This pair is very good for addressing aggressiveness, anxiety, rage, fear, neurosis, anguish, and psychological problems such as sadism and masochism. Again, please remember to be well hydrated before you get biomagnetic pair therapy and drink a lot of water after your treatment. One of the most th important things that I'm trying to stress about this treatment is that the magnets tend to dehydrate you. So it's very important. And on top of that, your, your body is going to be trying to detoxify itself after biomagnetic pair therapy. So it's very important to keep your body very well hydrated. The number of treatments it would take to um, help mitigate the conditions known as autism with any particular patient, of course, is different for every patient. I can't tell you how many treatments it's going to take. And I do not suggest that you only use biomagnetic pair therapy alone as uh, your treatment for treating autism. 
I believe that biomagnetic care therapy is a good treatment to use in conjunction with other treatments for autism. I'm going to follow this video with a few videos about neurofeedback as it is applied to addressing the symptoms known as autism. If you would like to learn how to perform biomagnetic pair therapy, neurofeedback, and all of the other therapies that we perform at the Biometrics Health Center, please become a patron on our Patreon page at patreon.com forward slash biomedrxtv. If you like this video, please hit the like button, comment, hit the bell for notifications, and by all means, subscribe to this channel. Thank you very much for watching Biomed RX TV.